Tonight's news is sponsored by Xenu. Trust Xenu. Be sorry about the Thetans. Three firefighters were lost in the blaze, but the duck was unharmed. Is your child at risk? Experts say the number of dishwasher accidents is on the rise. This man was elected president of the North American Union. Could it happen to you? Hey, let's see what's going on with Mr. Drebber, our friendly reporter. Hey, Paul. What's up? Free speech advocates voiced their disapproval today as the Ministry of Rights and Freedoms added another 3,200 words to the national redaction list. Uh, most of these words have already been eliminated from all media, including uh, websites, books, audio recordings, and of course, the dictionary. Freshly stricken words include uh, and Are you kidding me? I, I can't say That's ridiculous. Uh, there, there, there's locations in here, cities and whole countries. And, and What's the point? You can't hear anything I'm saying anyways. It's, it's actually very liberating. <laughs> I can really say whatever the fuck I want. Moving on. God said, I created good and I created evil. So what did man do? They created the devil. Because... Propagator. I'm Kelly Gardner with this news-breaking story. State officials released details today of NASA's latest successful mission. A new orbiting device of some kind was launched at short notice from an undisclosed site late last night. The object, not shown here for security reasons, is a satellite or possibly a space station, which will apparently be used by unnamed organizations for purposes unknown at this time. This is a proud day for a particular scientific or strategic aspect of your nation's undisclosed policies. With all the news you need, I'm Pearl Phillips. Today's broadcast was brought to you by Tang. Tang! It tastes! The Vice President was in today, speaking to about And Can you even tell what I'm saying? This is Bullshit. Bullshit. Wait. Wait a minute. Since when can I say bullshit? Well, I, I can say bullshit on the air, but I can't say... Well, this is bullshit. Bullshit! Bullshit. Well, there you go. Here we are, waiting for the next subject. If you're just joining us, we just saw a stunning display from the Americans. Yeah, they do make it look effortless, don't they, Jim? They certainly do, Bill. I haven't seen waterboarding like that since winter 2008. That's right, Jim. So the Lichtensteinian team will have to outdo that. They'll have to bring in the big guns and possibly some hammers. This is propagator. <laughs> If you don't like loud, obtrusive bleeping noises, you might want to turn the volume down on the old television set. <clears throat> In other news, Bo Kimball, <laughs> the son of Secretary of Defense Byron Kimball, was arrested in a raid on the New York all-male sex club Piston. He was engaged in acts of oral copulation and sodomy with multiple partners uh do you don't want to censor any of this no pardon me sodomy with multiple partners a cocktail of hard drugs was discovered on his person as well as submersive material concocted to paint our government as neo-fascist his arrest falls at a poor time for Defense Secretary Kimball, who is preparing for reappointment. Uh, wow, this guy must have really ticked somebody off. Uh, uh, oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. He did that interview with in that article in uh, in uh, where he said that he opposed uh, and so that's why he gets the. Uh, <laughs> The uncensored smear story because nobody, nobody in Washington messes with and his pack of cronies. It's a lot of bullshit. Oh, we got bullshit back.
Prostate cancer. Is your child at risk?